Hello, it's Flo, and maybe you know that yesterday I received my HTC One X V1, and uh, today I want to install a custom ROM, so to flash it. Uh, I don't want to create a new for a new um, Freedom XGA because there is already one created by the last Elian, and this 3D is just very good. So I just want to create some videos to add to this thread. So uh, you must already have installed the Android SDK. I don't want to do that, it's already done and it explains that very good. Then you have to backing up your data. Uh, you can also follow that. But I will just start with unlock bootloader. So let's go. First thing to do is to go on HTC dev. No, first thing to do is to go on your HTC device you have maybe to see that I am using the um, the software number 126, this is not the last one, but this is uh, another one and uh, I don't want to update it right now because I need to flash customer. Um, there is a USB debugging mode, you must check that and you must go on to power there and uncheck fast boot, this is uh, better. Okay, so when it's done, you have to go on um, your on HTC Dev this website here. Uh, you can unlock your bootloader. You have to select. You have to plug your phone uh, there like that. You have to plug your phone. I don't remember. me uh, register at the top. Yes, you have to register. So yes, login. Register and login. Login success. You are no login. Fair. So let's go to select your uh, your phone. I want to select the HTC One X, HTC One, HTC. Okay, maybe there is just One X. Where is this one? There. Okay, so all over supported. Maybe. Uh, once register and sign in, once in the support, begin unlock bootloader. Okay, so you have this message. Are you sure you want, wish to continue? You have to read it and you click yes. So this is because you will not have more warranty on your phone. So you have to acknowledge uh, use of unlock bootloader. You have to save all your data. I already have done that. So you have to proceed. Unlock instruction. So first thing is to remove and reinsert the battery uh, and go to the step 2. So I don't have the battery on HTC One X, you know, so let's just go to turn your phone off by this way, pull her off, and you must have fast boot unlocked to do that. When it's done, you have your phone just turned off. You have to reboot on fast boot mode. Fast boot mode is just easy. This is the same way to go to recovery, so just remember press the volume down button there, then press power button for 1 or 2 seconds, release the power button and continue to press the power down, uh, the volume down, excuse me. Now you are on fast boot mode. On this fast boot mode you have to um, connect your phone to your computer by this way, you know. Oh. By this way, yes. And it turn on fast boot USB must do that. Connect to your computer, power to fast boot. Okay, you click fast boot and you have fast boot USB. To select fast boot you press power, power button. Then you go proceed to step 5. Okay, here we are. Okay, step 5. You must have already installed the uh, Android SDK, so you must have on this folder the AGB, so we are Android SDK tools there. You must have AGB. You must have also uh, over files AGB Win AP and Fastboot. So AGB Win AP and Fastboot is here. You must have these three different files. Um, okay. Then you have to uh, to find this file. You have to go on Android SDK Payphone Tool. Yes, you have to install it. Fastboot to find it. You have to install it. When it's done, you have to go on the uh, command. You have to go there execute and launch CMG, like that. To do that, you have to go on the folder when you place your uh, fastboot and AGB. So mine is uh, cgc slash android sdk 
windows slash tools okay and you must have this uh, location for uh, for your AGB and fastboot this is maybe another one for you you have to check that when it's done then you have to enter a command prompt okay proceed to step 8 when it's done you have to enter different commands those commands are fastboot OEM get identifier token so let's go to do that there fast boot OEM get underscore identifier underscore token okay so you must choose it uh, just to resave a file okay then you have to uh, you have received this uh, part of code you have to click right there and select you must select from this part before identifier token to the end there then click right this has selected all this this text and copy it you have to go to the down of this page and you have to click uh, there on enter token and you have to pass it there you know this part my device identifier token is there and you have to submit it and now you must resave uh, the page of request does not exist uh -huh. Return to a page. Yes, maybe. Okay, why? Um, maybe I have already done that with this mail. Yes, okay, I know why. Uh, okay, login. Login success. Step 8. Past. Submit. And looking at the day following expression to gain okay so if this is not working you have to check that and just logging again so unlocking bootloader instruction take the following steps token submitted successfully so now you have to go on your mail to check that is that this one i hope uh, comments this is not this one wow which one is it uh flow to connect disconnect that maybe Okay, uh, so there you reset on your Gmail this uh, this file. Click here to continue. You have to download the unlock bin, uh, uh, unlock code bin. So you have to take it. You have to copy that. Go into your uh, locations. This is the location of your Android SDK Windows, uh, where you have agb.exe, and you must see I already have one. So I have to put number B, I have to paste it and I have to enter, I have just to change the name, you can just keep this one and 1x, okay. I have the unlock code 1x.bin. When I get that, I can go to click here to continue uh, the instructions. So let's go there, continue the different instructions. Step 11. You have to uh, resave that, download it, and you have to en enter this command. So let's go to your command here and just enter that. You have to enter fast boot. Excuse me. Fast boot is just to uh, say that you must use the fast boot. What we are we doing with that? We must to flash the unlock token and we have to enter the name of this unlock token this is unlock code underscore 1x.bin for me but you have to check if this is yours or not and then you press enter you have writing uh, unlock token there you have some instructions you have to see that and on your device you have this screen right now so you have to press yes unlock the bootloader not that not fair this one Okay, you can't uh, press the screen to do that. You must choose the volume key. So there, you have seen. You press the volume key. Okay, please. Volume key, maybe you see that. Yeah, maybe better. Okay, and to press enter, you press power. Then you have seen something change here. Finish total 35 seconds. And your phone is just uh, now unlocked for the bootloader and it reboot as normally.
So thanks again to have seen this video and let's go to continue the auto that's flow. Thanks.